Well, hey guys, how are you doing? Happy Friday. Um, so the Lord gave me a message today. Um, it's May 26, 2023. I claim that Jesus Christ is Son of God. He's God. He came to earth as a man in the flesh. He bled on the cross and died for our sins, and he rose on the third day, and he was also born of a virgin. Um, <clears throat> ignore the Telegram and the WhatsApp people because they're trying to scam you on YouTube for a fake orphanage. All right. Time is short, guys. Believe in Jesus. We don't know as soon as to the Father, but um, his messages seem to get, you know, a little more instructional every time. So, Colossians 1.9. <clears throat> for this reason, we also, since the day we heard it, do not cease to pray for you and to ask that you may be filled with the knowledge of his will and all wisdom and spiritual understanding. James 3.9. With it, we bless our God and Father, and with it, we curse men who have been made in the similitude of God. First Thessalonians 4, 8. Therefore, he who rejects this does not reject man, but God, who has also given us his Holy Spirit. Mark 3, 8. And Jerusalem and Idumea and beyond the Jordan and those from Tyre and Sidon, a great multitude, when they heard how many things he was doing, came to him. Ne Nehemiah, Nehemiah 1 5. And I said, I pray, Lord God of heaven, O great and awesome God, you who keep your covenant and mercy with those you, who love you and observe your commandments. Okay, here's the message. My child, seven, sevenfold destruction, seven is the key. It's here. Wake up. Toronto explosion, earthquake in Nebraska. My child, fires, lots of forest fires are coming. Not only acres in the woods, but lots of farms will be destroyed. Missouri is one of them. The enemy is determined to burn it all, erasing the food supply and making it difficult to produce more product, making it difficult for you to stay in your homes and breathe. I told you eminent domain is coming and you will not receive restitution. Do you see the chain of events happening? It's all falling into place. The first collapse of economy brings in digital currency. Then pandemics will increase tenfold. Look around, it's happening now. You will hear even more soon. But it won't just be Marburg, fungus, and SARS respiratory. It's also going to be autoimmune diseases popping up everywhere. What are they spraying in the air right now? It's all part of their plan. They are trying to isolate you and trap you in a certain section of the country so they can quarantine, depopulate, and control you. Children, you have no idea what's coming. You haven't even begun to see what the Great Tribulation is. Do you really think I would let my bride, my prize, go through that kind of destruction and chaos? The wrath is for the wicked, not my chosen ones, not my children. I am a loving God. I am gentle and kind, but I'm also a wrathful God. When you deny my son, who I have sent to shed his blood and die for you on the cross, so you may be saved. If Jesus, if Jesus doesn't know you, I don't know you. If you believe in my son, accept his free gift of salvation. He will reveal you to me. Who am I, I say to you? I am the father, the great I am. If you have seen Jesus, you have seen me. Do not twist scripture, children. It's all in my word. Being sent to you in the flesh, but also recognizing me in the spirit. Do you get the correlation now? It's written plainly for you to see. Have you seen it yet? You walk in deception and you are a worker bee being cursed under the law. I told you if you are bound by the law, you are relying on your works to get you to heaven. What did I die for? Oh, you are foolish and wicked and your hearts are hardened. You speak and I didn't appoint you to speak. Did I tell you to attack your neighbor? Did I tell you to judge your neighbor? Have you asked me to reveal the truth to you? 
Most of you will perish for your lack of knowledge. I told you to seek me for discernment and pray for my will. Have you done that? My people warn you and warn you. I send you dreams. I send you visions. I fill my people with words of knowledge. I gave you so many signs and you still think my coming is far off. Wake up, O oh sleeper. I am outlining the ending for you. Every word spoken will come to pass. Do you even know what I have created? Do you even know what the devil has mocked, mimicked, changed, and hid from you? Almost everything I have created, he has twisted it, including my word. I told you my true word was in the Geneva Bible. I told you the calendars have been changed. I have revealed my plan to my prophets. They are speaking what I have unsealed that I had hidden and closed up till the end for thousands of years. I told you in the end times it would be revealed to you. Wake up, children. This is the end. But it's only the beginning. The wicked will be enslaved and the righteous will be free. How do you become righteous? You believe in me and confess I am Lord. You give me your heart and you please me with your faith. I tell you the truth. You will have to come like a child to enter my kingdom. Your words and your scolding is going to be the death of you. Who else had pride? Who else fell? Lucifer did. Humble yourselves. Don't invent your own calling. Did I call everyone to be a teacher, a prophet, or a minister? I called you to seek my will, and it will be revealed to you. Keep knocking, and you will receive. When I am behind you, what can man do? When I'm behind you, you won't fail. Trust in me and I will show you the way. I love you. I love all of you, even the wicked. And I came to save the world, not condemn it. I'm calling my people up and it's soon. Don't miss the call. I'm your deliverer, your rescuer, your father and your Messiah. And I've spoken. Seek me with all of your hearts, like the heart of David, and I will save you. There's a reason I say David is the key. When you trust in me and believe in me with all of your heart, you will have the key of David. Wake up, children. This hour could be your last. I am your Lord God, and I have spoken. John 2, 9. When the master of the feast had tasted the water that was made wine and did not know where it came from, but the servants who had drawn the water knew the master of the feast called the bridegroom. 2 Peter 2, 3. By covetousness, they will exploit you with deceptive words. For a long time, their judgment has not been idle, and their destruction does not slumber. Lamentations 1.9 Her uncleanliness is in her skirt. She did not consider her destiny. Therefore, her collapse was awesome. She had no comforter. O Lord, behold my affliction, for the enemy is exalted. The Lord is shaking me right now. Psalm 68 <clears throat> I have set the Lord always before me, because he is at my right hand. I shall not be moved. Jeremiah 2 3. Israel was holiness to the Lord, the first fruits of his increase. All that devour him will offend. Disaster will come upon them, says the Lord. Isaiah 111. To what purpose is the multitude of your sacrifices to me, says the Lord? I have had enough of burnt offerings of rams and the fat of fed kettle. cattle. I do not delight in the blood of bulls or of lambs or goats. <sighs> Matthew 6 3. But when you do a charitable deed, do not let your hand know what your right hand is doing. Luke 14, 3. And Jesus answered, spoken to the lawyers and Pharisees, saying, Is it lawful to heal on the Sabbath? 1 Thessalonians 2, 11. As you know how we extorted and comforted and charged every one of you as a father does his own children. Um, John 3, 11. Most assuredly, I say to you, we speak what we know and testify what we have seen, and you do not receive our witness. Okay, guys, that was the message from Jesus. Um, trust in him. Do not rely on your own understanding. You guys always walk in the spirit. You are saved by your faith and his grace. Guys, it's about coming to the kingdom like a little child. And um, the Lord is, I don't think he has a message. Okay, I heard my child tell them I am coming. I am coming. Guys, Jesus is coming, so please wake up. He's trying to wake you up. He's trying to save you guys. I don't know when he's coming, but I know it's soon. I can feel it in my spirit. I can feel his urgency. Confess Jesus Christ as your Lord today. Come with him with all your hearts. Believe in him. It is your faith in his grace that saves you. Okay, guys, God bless. Have a blessed weekend.